Turning to President Biden now, spending his first weekend away from the White House, back in Delaware, stopping by for an x-ray on that injured foot, but still pushing for his nearly $2 trillion relief bill, reaching out to a California woman who lost her job in the pandemic. ABC's Alex Perche is in Delaware. Tonight, President Biden making the pitch for his COVID relief plan directly to American people in need of assistance. I was laid off in July. And Speaking to a woman who lost her job named Michelle as as in a video released by the White House. We're putting together a plan that provides for emergency relief to people who are in desperate need now. Everything from mortgage payments to unemployment insurance to rental subsidies to food security for children. Recent polling indicates Biden's $1.9 trillion package already has the support of most Americans, including 37% of Republicans. But Republicans in the Senate are frustrated the president and Democrats are pushing it through along party lines. They're not interested in doing the hard work it takes to build consensus. Looks like you're pushing your agenda with the disguise of wanting to interact and then doing it 100% the direction you want to go. The fact is, Democrats don't need any GOP votes. But President Biden says he's open to compromise on some things, like which Americans get a stimulus check based on income. But he's not budging on the amount of those checks, $1,400. Alex Perche is with us now in Wilmington, Delaware tonight. And Alex, President Biden has acknowledged that he won't get everything he wants in this plan. That includes a $15 minimum wage, saying he doesn't think it will survive. That's right, Whit. President Biden says his guess is that it will not be included. But he also says that he's prepared to negotiate separately on minimum wage and work it up from where it is now. Whit. All right, Alex, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.